My name's Ashley. I'm the older sister of Melissa. Um, my favorite song. This is a difficult one. Difficult one for me, but it would be a tie between Take Me There by Anna Golden and When You Walk Into the Room by William McDowell. Um, let's see some interesting facts about me. My favorite color is purple. I am a distributor with the It Works. And I have been leading singer at the church I currently go to now for about I mean, I'll say maybe for about eight or nine months maybe. Eight, I don't think it's quite been a year yet. Oh, eight or nine months. So your time Melissa. Alright, so my name is Marissa. Um you all saw me earlier as I was giving like an introduction about our about the ministry that the Lord has entrusted my sister and I with. She's she's actually a helpmate of mine. She really helps me a lot. I really I really appreciate her help throughout this new journey, this new process that the Lord has gave us um, to start off with. Um, so, as Ashley mentioned before, my name is Marissa Smith. I am the, obviously the baby of all the um, of all of our siblings. I am also um, a singer. Um, this is what the Lord has called us into, is music ministry. All right. Um, some facts. Uh, the thing that I do there at our church in Trinity for Gospel in Morton, Arkansas, um, I teach the little ones there at my at my church. And the name of the group is called Talks for Christ. It's something that the Lord had gave me. Um, interesting fact about me: uh, my favorite color is, is pink. I love pink. I think that is the most awesome color around. Um, um my favorite song, I probably have to. Way between um, I Am by Eddie James or um, what's another one? Take Me There is for good self there. Well, I like Take Me There too. But I think my all time favorite contemporary song would probably have to be I Am by Eddie James. Um, a favorite hymnal of mine is just Over in the Glory Land. I don't know the artist. All right, so I actually want to go ahead and share your testimony first. What God's done for you? All right. Um, since the beginning of this year, in late January, um, the Lord has, you know, beginning to open the doors for me. Um, um, it's been like a really amazing journey to like to where I have been in the past, but where I'm going to now. Um, like I've opened the Lord has opened my eyes to the, a lot of new things, and and like the Anna Golden song says, just when I thought I couldn't go deeper, you pull me close and show me more. All right. So I'm um, starting. I guess I will go backwards a little about. Fast forward about nine or ten months ago, um, from where Ashley started her testimony so back in April the 2nd 2016 um, a good friend of my family's um, Mr. Randy Williams um, suddenly passed away of a massive heart attack here in Tree Valley um, it was a very tough time it was a very hard time um, it was just it was very shocking when he passed away and then shortly after that, Miss Christy Sides passed away. She was another good family friend of ours. And then uh, almost two months after Miss Christy passed away, Brother Bill Spencer passed away. And that was very heartbreaking. It was it was very much a shock. Although we had known him for like a year, it was he honestly he felt like he was one of, he was a true member of our family. And it was, that was a shock. Um, but since um, during that time, I went through a series of depression and trials, and I went through a season where I felt like God had left me. I felt like God was nowhere around. Um, but um, fast forward to January the 26th of this year, we went to a revival, and there at the um, Calvary, I think Calvary Apostolic Church. 
and win, which is, if you don't know where that's at, that's just right behind the Ross Forest, right there on the highway. You can't miss it. Um, so we went there. Um, honestly, I felt like we needed to go. Um, there's an urging in my heart telling me that we needed to go. And we were invited by, actually, by a friend of my sister's to go. So we went. Um, I was, at the time, I was still going through that, you know, that series of depression. Um, and then, um, the, uh, man by the name of Brother David Bryan, um, he is a, he's a, a man of God, he's an evangelist, and he's also pastored there at Grace Point Church in Cincinnati, Ohio, which is a ways from here. Um, so, we went, and I felt like, when he started preaching, I felt like, literally, like, he was preaching straight at me. Like, I just, I just really felt like he was preaching straight at me. And then he said at the end of his message, he said that there was, um, that there was somebody in the, that you're sitting in the front row that you're needing a healing in your body. And I was sitting with my family in the front row and I, I just knew that was me. I just knew that I knew that I knew he was talking about me. So I went up there because at the time I had really bad eczema. So I expected to get healed from that, but then instead I got something more. I went up there. And that there was these um, um, worship leaders there at that church that was praying with me, which is just extra confirmation to what God has called us into. And so then he went up to me, and then the Lord just began to reveal some things about me to him. And then, you know, as that time went on, he prayed for me, and like the power of God hit me, and like I started bawling like a baby. Because I, you know, keep in mind, I didn't know this guy from Adam, and he didn't know me. Um, so, like I said, we continued, we prayed, and then, then afterwards, after the Lord had um, delivered me from the depression and the other things that I was going through, the Lord also filled me with the Holy Ghost that night. So, there's my testimony. God bless you. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah, and our contact information will be linked up below. Um, below. Hit that little bed button. Hit the subscribe button. Come on, what's the dance with me? Come on. All right. So, our Facebook page is the, um, HTTPS, um, those little colon, and then slash slash Facebook.com slash Three New Eyes Ministries, and then our G, our Ministries email is three new eyes at gmail.com and it's all lowercase lettered. But like I said, just click that little red button and you'll subscribe to our page and you will receive more information about our ministry. God bless.